I guess to continue being that kind of YouTuber, I need to do another question on my... on my YouTube channel, right? To be one of those, one of those, uh... Did you make that comment yourself? I've made barely any comments myself, and that is not one of them. To continue taking advantage of how polls work, I need to make another poll, right? What should I do? Make the software engineer one? No, I haven't made that one. Hey, pony jumper. Like, are you scared of the water since you played Subnautica? Or just, are you scared of open water? That's probably a good one. Copper is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has yeah, just let's increased do that. to unlikely. I'll do that after the stream, Pog. The Aurora suffered orbital hull Hey, Frankie. Yeah, the more do you know, the better. Yeah, yeah. I, I was legit interested in the answer to have you played and finished the Nordica. What, it was like it was like 70-30 or something? First two limestone waste one couple of titanium and with that commit have a scanner. You can leave when stuff's building like so and then I'm going to head over to wreck to grab myself some sea glide fragments. Someone told the water because it is slightly faster. I'm going to wreck because most of that place is sea glide can spawn. I can spawn only when the safe channel is just more likely to wreck. Didn't get that poll. Yeah, I, I don't really know how polls are advertised to people. You, maybe you ignored it. Who even knows? Oh, I didn't fully scan this. Smart. Or not smart. Who knows? Who's going to participate in the lockout? Currently no one. Another idea. Did you watch both parts of the 100% all the way through? I made them. I was there when the, the scrolls were written. What do you mean, did I watch this? That's a lot of doggos. Will any of them drop any teeth? Will any of the doggos drop any of the teeth? One tooth. That was so many pickups, and I got one tooth out of that? Time zones are a bit tricky for lockout. It is true. It is true. Gonna go through this coral tube and grab myself a lot of resources. You will notice I am breaking rocks a little bit faster than normal. That's because you find the scroll wheel to one of your action keys, and each scroll comes with multiple inputs of that action. Pretty fantastic for in the guest game, because normally I have to click four times to make these rocks at the atmosphere side, but now I can just scroll once. You do it for running at least 30 FPS, and you want to scroll slowly, not quickly, because scrolling quickly actually makes it worse. Also trying to do some sort of helix like motion to grab these resources in a smooth fashion can be a little bit awkward though, depending on the resource distribution. Fix it versus sound a lockout again when? I mean, it only happened the once, right? Or maybe was it twice? Maybe, I think it was twice. But I mean, Vixip's not really active anymore, so... Is it right above me? Where's my base? That was so weird. Is a lockout just a group of people racing to complete a bingo? No. A lockout is people competing to do a bingo, and if someone does a bingo goal, then no one else can. If you have any job in the world, what would you be? A software engineer. Can I make myself a knife and a two tank and a sea glide? Hold down the sprint key to get the menu open. I need five metal. I've got it like a billion. Holding the sprinkies is fantastic, would highly recommend you do so, even in your casual playthrough. That's once again holding the sprinkie to get the menu open. Uh, while I like the like the idea, Lucky, to be a big YouTube abusing poll person thing, I'm meant to make it like super generic so people who don't even haven't even played Subnautica can answer can respond. Two and one is five. I need seventy to twenty quarts, two soda gold, three table coal, and as much limes as I can carry. Six, seven, a rocco, eight. Nine. Do you like oxygen? Do you like cheese? Hmm.
Would you ever speed on No Man's Sky? Will the reference is like four minutes? Uh, probably not. I only speed on games that I finished and really enjoyed. And I have, while I am playing No Man's Sky, I've yet to finish it. It's unfortunate that I had to stay around to get hit by the crash fish. How'd you finish No Man's Sky? Don't know. No, you have a Twitch account. I think the idea is to be even more generic than that, Lucky. It shouldn't be anything about me at all. That's a lot of stuff. Need all this. Metal count, like one. Activate ghost storage. Get myself a base. Do you read the description? Turn it into a sandwich. No. With a hatch. Never get how I feel if she exposed when threatened survives on this planet. Uh, I was going under the assumption that it was a... The, the plant is parasitic. And causes the fish to explode. We always stream the Subnautica. Green Pro Zero once it's fully finished. Who knows? Who knows? Do I know? No, I Power do not know. That Captain. weird thing skips exit animations. Gonna make myself two glass, two lockers, two windows, and that'll flood my base. If we take the whole string down to less than zero, it starts flooding because that's just how the game be. And now I need six mushrooms, ten table cross, some other stuff. So that's six. This. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Grab these two sandstone to get to a nice round eight. What's my quartz count? My quartz count is perfect. Back to base. Is the base so much new? No, it's been around for about a year. At least one more metal salvage, so we'll do that. That's two metal. I just got so much uh, limestone that it's just a bit weird. Lego mom's in here. That's this, this. Lego mom's in here. That's everything else. And I've activated a glitch. If you're in a base when it floods, or if you're in a flooded base and you deconstruct and reconstruct a hatch or a window, the game will think about swimming and walking at the same time, so it puts those two speeds together. Pretty fantastic. Makes you go very fast. Called Super Sea Glider, and now I need some teeth. Every time a dog picks up a piece of metal, there's a chance it drops a tooth. That chance is 25%. And I need four by 8.30, but we got it now, so that's good enough. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Hey, Hannah, thank you for luck. So I need a rupture, like the one behind me that's spewing out water. If I didn't have that rupture, I wouldn't be able to do this deconstruction section, because at some point it would stop being flooded, and that'd be very bad for me. Upgrading my two tank right now is the current goal. Lego Mom's in here, that's this, this, this. Lego Mom's in here, that is everything else. 10 minus 6 is 4. Count is 5, count is 0. You can activate a glitch called Ghost Storage. Open the locker in the light pod. Little animation, then open your PDA. If you leave an animation playing, the game gets confused. Doesn't need a PDA. Next time you do open your PDA, no matter where you are, you can access that locker. And. Now I can look at chat for a bit because I've got to do a lot of counting. Chat is indeed cringe. One, two, three. Every second of this, guys, are going to take a tick of damage. If we're in the main blast, can take a lot more. So we can try and avoid that. That's one. Counting to 24 there. That is the fourth. So this is two. Three, four, five, six. 
six, seven, eight. Another little bonus super sea glide. Nine. You can rub yourself against stingers as much as you want. They're not going to hurt you. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Also crashes you know you're around. Thirteen. Fourteen. So they're going to stay in their little house. Other creatures of the sea do still know you're around. Fifteen. But you're so fast you can outrun them. Maybe not the mesmers though because they're just in the wrong place. Sixteen at the right time I guess. Sixteen. Five is the count. Nothing of 16.6. There you go. Up for air. Dump this in here. Dump all this. And some lead in there, I guess. 16.6 is the count. Still got like a chance. 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23. 24, now two silver, one gold. Gold, silver, one more silver. No. Silver? No. Silver? Yes. Look at the life pod. Where's the life pod? Go right. Dump all this lead because I don't need it. I'm at six though, so I need more metal salvage. Heading over to a wreck. It's over here. Just takes a little while to spawn in. Gonna do a little magic trick. If I build inside it, it disappears. And now I need two boxes, a supply box, and a lot of mobile vehicle bays. There's one box. There's another box. Mobile vehicle bay. Mobile vehicle bay. Mobile vehicle bay. Cool. Seven. Do I need the silver? I can't remember. I might do. I'm going up for air. And down. Eight. Nine. Slash, 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 slash. Cool. Ingot while the ingot's making, head over here. One, two, three, four, back we go. Grab a bit of air. More metal and all this. Another ingot while that's making, deconstruct two and a half piece of my base. This. And this, actually three, why not? And this. Sure. Grab all these but one, grab lots of copper. While those are making, deconstruct the glass. Sure, I should have made that earlier, but whatever. One, two, three, and this. What's the count for mountain resources? What do you mean? You mean lithium gold? It's 14, three. this stuff and all this and all this and start making some more things two copper wire and this I guess grab this dump the med kits in there sure why not ghost storage Grab 
grab this, grab two of these. I'm too fast. Right. One, two, three, four. Cool. Uh, Temple this in here. Grab this, grab this, switch. Dump two of these. Uh, six here. Yeah. This, this, these. Swap batteries. Make myself a power cell. Make myself this. And make myself this. Leave. And now we go. Dump, dump, and dump these, dump this, activate ghost storage, activate super sea light, and leave. Cool. That is a gold. Gonna head over to. That could have been faster. I was a little bit shaky on the resource, the crafting at the end. Gonna head over to the Mountain Island now, grab some resource I can't get in my base, grab some fragments I can't get in my base, and do the Storm Island in order to You show me right, there's a Storm Island, I'm gonna go do that now. I need a fish. New spade fish pot. I need to remember to grab the proportion cannon first. So I need fragments and shale. Shale means I start counting lithium gold in that order. And fragments are pretty convenient. If I somehow get five before a certain point, I can do a yellow man. Otherwise, it's just nice to have them now. Hey, Jason, thank you for the luck. Grab a lot of air. And down. Nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Nothing there, nothing there. Overlay some animations. Saves about two seconds. Very exciting, it looks really weird. Oh, there's a thing. Zero, one, one, one. Need to get to 14, three ideally. Two, one. Three, one. Four, one. Five, one. Remember the materials you gather are the property. Nope, of that's the just the floor. Five, two, six, two, six, three. Seven three eight three nine three that'll do. Make myself one of them their bases. With a hatch. No, Boris. Bad Boris bad. No Boris, no, no, no. You stay over there. Over there. Over there. Go over here, do some fancy imagery management, dump this stuff. Grab this, grab this, dump this stuff, dump this, grab all this, and eat this. Find myself a fish. There's one over here. Use it to flood the base. Go over here. Dump this, dump this, dump this, dump this, dump this. One, two, three, four, five. And head over. Nine, three is the count. That's good. Ten, three. Engine. Another engine. I need two moon pool. New blueprint acquired. One. Thirty seconds. Cool. There's the second one. Nice, nice, nice. 11, 3, 12, 3, 13, 3. That'll do for now. Oxygen. Do you drop all the medkits? No, I keep one. Grab a lot of air. Go slightly to the left of my base. And down. How much is the world record? Tree fiddy. It is tree fiddy. Head over here. Push down and deploy. Climb out of bounds. Grab this leaf. Do you never run into the matter reefer? You see her and hear her briefly, but she's never really close enough. So we're just going down to the Lost River. It looks like we're not swimming, but with Super Sea Glide, we do swim like this. It's weird, but don't worry about it too much. The biomass in this area is dominated by plant life. 
picking up faint. A slasher. Signatures. We said a Casper, the friendliest ghost Leviathan. If Casper says I back, Casper blesses the run. And now I need some nickel. Nickel's a tiny little thing, less play hand and seek, and I need three of it. You play this game for long enough, everything in this area starts looking out nickel. The floor, the fish, the bubbles the fish give off, the shale, the lava. It's all nickel. And of course, nickel's a tiny little potato, so it's kind of hard to spot, even at the best of times. That's a shale. One. There's two. And three. Not great. Kevin's a big loud boy, likes eating glitches runners. I need four crystals, four kyanite, that's one zero. Which has formed in this area can be carbon dated to one, the one, and three one, two, one three. And this is a clip A, I believe. Right? Is it clip A? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, clip A. Do you have a dog IRL? No, I'm allergic to them. A large nickel, you can totally grab it. Do the hardcore jump, which is less hardcore than survival jump. Grab the cube, open the door. Do you have a cat or No, I'm allergic to those as well. Hey, more. Hypoallergenic. I can't be bothered. Integrating new PDA data. Synthesizing. Ion. Powered blueprints from alien data. Unfortunately, unlike survival, we do actually have to walk out of here. Do you have a stalker IRL? I don't know. Contact, it is to this guy. Walkie walkie walkie. I still need three kyanite, which is really rough, but... Up for air. That's not air, but sort of not water. That gets you the super sea glides, which is why we did this. Still need the three kyanite though. One. There you go, two, three. Not great, but it'll do. There was one there. Thanks, game. Find a very specific spot. Clip out of bounds. With the mobile vehicle bay in just the right way, you can clip out of bounds. And while mobile vehicle bays exist in this game, so I'm going to use that to my advantage and leave that one there. And now I need a one out of bounds sulfur. One singular out of bounds sulfur. If I go inbounds, obviously run is rip. There we go, because it's out of bounds sulfur, not inbounds sulfur. Oh, there we go. Show, grab the cube. So Big Mama's a little bit confused right now. She's waiting for someone to come in the correct way, but no one's ever going to do that, so she's just going to power post the end of time. Does so Silver spawn out of bounds, or are you collecting it from out of bounds? It is in bounds. I'm collecting it from out of bounds. Also, with Super Sea Glide, you can slightly clip through everything, so I can clip through the sand My slightly, activate a pedestal, and we. To play outside this place. We have been here so long. The others built a passage to speed the the outside. I asked them for this freedom. Need but this, this, they this, could this. Not hear me. If Into you the base help I go. us, I will give you freedom. Wait, have to. The others tried in vain. There you go. Do the hatching enzymes. Deconstruct this for the gold. Leave. Get my 2002 because that's how the game works. 
Environment scans indicate the water here is rich with a rare plankton-like life form, which depends on... Because you gain air whenever you go through a powered door, unless you go through a powered door into a flooded base, but the outside world isn't a flooded base, so it doesn't count. Hatch the babies, and they're actually immediately outside, so I'm going to go say hi. My young can leave this place. First they must feel the time is right, and break free of their shells. This is what the others could not force from me. To you, I give the secret willingly. PB, there's still 20 minutes left, essentially. Just under. Wow, nudging me slightly to the left. Thanks, baby. So, on this patch, a lot of the walls in this area are just sort of vice. You can hop straight through them. On the current patch, you do have to walk in normally. But it doesn't waste too much time, so we can just hop through the wall and swim through here. Thank you, Hyrule, for the luck. Is there any way to skip the queuing animation? Hey, variant, watch my glitches video that I've got up on YouTube. Yeah, I think. Thank you very much for the luck. I don't remember what the command is for it. Skipping animation does indeed ruin everything. Unfortunately. Because you get cured once the animation finishes. Grab that tablet. Aim in a certain way so I can take this momentum with me in the fork. Up. Take a minute, kid. So I need one more lithium, I believe. Go over here, deconstruct this for the metal. In I go. Grab Super Sea Glide. Hey, hi, Leek. Thank you for the luck. Grab those. I'm out of here. No, I need that. I need that quartz actually. Whoops. There we go. Now I'm out of here. So I need one lithium. <laughs> Mabel, you got any lithium? Hey, Mabel. You do? Wow, so kind, so generous. Bye, Mabel. Hey, Luna, thank you for the like. Hey, Fluffy. Hey, Alish, thank you for the luck. Now I'm going to head over to the Aurora. Going to get what is essentially the final blueprint of the game. I say the final blueprint of the game because it's the blueprint that lets you actually finish the game. Thank you, Mentor, for the luck. To do so, we're going to go through a maintenance hatch, which is definitely intended. Don't worry about it. And it does exist on current patch. It just disappears when the Aurora explodes. So if you can't find it, it's because your Aurora has exploded. Also, this is why I have a ton of medkits, because we're just going to face tank the radiation. What's the best thing you can do on a Cyclops for height? There's some really weird ones, but they're all completely useless. If I'm brave enough, I will scan that on the way out. How you do it? Uh, go to speedrun Discord. I put a video up recently in science. So this is the maintenance hatch. Head on through. Make myself a lovely base. With a hatch. Find the copper. All that. That does. And flood the base. Now I'm going to go over and do something you can't do on current patch. Hey, Thespian, thank you for the luck. Head over here. Find myself this. And just jump straight through the floor. I want this water. Two, six, seven, nine is always the code. Thank you, Willow, for the luck. Open the door, get on the floor, grab that. And on this patch, not on the current patch, I need to take this, so I may as well. You can use the doors to jump through the ceiling. And we're failing right now, which is great. There you go, that was roof, whatever. 
That was roof. And now we're going to swim over here where my base is somewhere. It's over here somewhere. This, this. Yeah, basey, basey, basey. Is that my basey? That's my basey. Head on in. Deconstruct, reconstruct for Super Siglide. Leave. Deconstruct this for the two metal. And then somehow get out without going above the water. There you go. I do this a little bit slower than I could, but that's fine because I get to leave. And split. Because I'm really, really greedy. I'm gonna scan that. I do have another med kit, so it's actually not that greedy. I'm gonna head over to the spa street now, grab some more glorious resources. We can't get him a base. Grab some fragments. I can't get him a base. No more storyline this time. Unfortunately. Thank you again, Irish, for the luck. I don't know whether I need to do that because I'm quite fast, but I'm going to do it anyway just to be safe. If I run out of battery, it's really, really annoying. So I need a salt, which is why I'm swimming low here. There you go. And up there. How'd you participate in a raid? Uh, do you mean for channel points? You stay around till the end of the stream. Hey, light. And hey, Missy, thank you for the luck. Grab a lot of air here. And then straight down after the glorious guardian of the cave. I need two rubies, two gel sacks, no lithium. But if I see a lithium, I'm going to pick it up, because just in case. Gel sack. Nice double ruby. Gel sack. Sure, lithium. Now I leave. Where's that wreck? There it is. Use that to line myself up for the next area. Head on over and down into this thing. Thank you, Stanford, for the luck. Open said door and Stanford for the luck again. And Stanford for the luck again. I need four crystals, so unfortunately can't say four for the other runner if I didn't pick up the one earlier. And Stanford for the luck again. Crazy cat. Left and right, then left again. Got myself a fish, but I missed. That's fine, I guess. This fish? Yeah. And we're going to do a little magic trick. If you build inside a wreck, it disappears, as I've already explained before, but we're going to do it again. I need three bridge, three hull. Actually, two bridge, three hull, because I've already got a... What is this? No. I still have the propulsion cannon, which is annoying. Whatever, I guess. Hey, Regret, thank you for the luck. I don't need any more bridge, just hull, thanks. That's not hull. One, two, three. Wait for the lag to go away. Three. Hull, please. Hull, please. Hull, please. Random hull, just on the floor. Up for air. Damage to plant life on the seafloor suggests this may be the migration path of a huge bottom dwelling life form. Random hull on the floor. Random hull on the floor. There. Random hull on the floor. Acquired. Need to collect a couple bladderfish on the way. No, if there was hull there, I wouldn't have need to go up for air. So, I guess you could grab a bottle of uh, bladderfish if you were, uh, were going to be unlucky, I suppose. Use flare strat. Hmm. What means dark orange in light split? Uh, behind. I've changed the things so it's not red. For reasons. 
I unfortunately have to do a little de detour to try and get a metal salvage. There you go. I'm full. That's because I got the propulsion cannon. There you go. Dump all this stuff, and all this stuff, grab these, grab this, grab this, grab this, switch, uh, this, this, and these, and I need a glass. Where's the glass? Where's the glass? Where's the glass? It's upstairs! No! How could you do this to me? How could you do this to me myself? I did it to me. Grab all this stuff, and that lithium, I guess. I don't really need it, but okay. Dump all this, and all this, and uh, grab this. Dump, dump. Okay. That's really rough, but whatever, I guess. I'm gonna do some fancy stuff that no one knows actually why it works, but we do it anyway. This, this, window, deconstruct this. Make a tiny piece. How do you do this? You do exactly what I'm doing. You do something that isn't what I'm doing, it probably won't work. You're gonna make a moon pool. You make the moon pool, there's two moon pools. You deconstruct the outer moon pool, there's a moon pool inside. Try and deconstruct the outer moon pool, not the inner moon pool. Gonna make that moon pool again. Deconstruct the outer moon pool, there's a moon pool inside. Deconstruct, reconstruct, there's two moon pool. Deconstruct the outer moon pool, there's a moon pool inside. We have to find a spot where we can actually deconstruct it though. And deconstruct, reconstruct, there's two moon pool. Deconstruct the outer moon pool, there's a moon pool inside. Again, have to find where we can actually deconstruct it. And deconstruct the final one. And so I've heard tale of a wild mobile vehicle bay. Let's see if we can sneak up on it and capture it. And full, sure, some lead. There you go. Find a very specific spot. Here, here, up. And deploy. This. Back to base. The final crafting section now. I shouldn't have done that, but I keep thinking because it looks like it's uh, it looks like that that I have to do that, but I didn't need to do that. So, but I don't leave the base very much now, so it's fine, right? It's just fine, right? Didn't make these, that's unfortunate. And up. Yeah, we, we do the moon pull there because you can't build this, the big things in the middle of the, uh, the safe shallows. Unfortunately, I wish we could, but we cannot. Uh, grab this stuff. Dump, 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 dump. Grab all this, and I need that as well. Uh, uh, this. There you go. And the final crafting. I'm pretty sure we did oh, but uh, maybe not. That's the best place to craft stuff from, because it's the closest to go over, back over here. What was the tooth time anyway? Sub 8, I believe. Too much lubricant? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always forget to dump the lubricant. But it doesn't matter, we got everything. So. I'm pretty sure. I know, yeah, we got everything. So again, standing here. If spawns close to the island, do you ever go there before you get sea glide? No, never, ever, 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 ever. You would never ever do something without Sea Glide if you could get Sea Glide instead. 
You can climb up the ladder from the outside. Head on through. Do the only thing we made the Cyclops 4, which is the Cyclops Shield Generator. Hey, Blau, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Is this fine? This is a PB, right? This is fine. This is a PB, right? PB? Yeah, PB. Nice. As long as I have the resources, which I think I do. I don't need lead, do I? What do I need for the next section? Is it that? Hey, yeah, metal boy. Short range scan suggests this so this is the best place to sand because we're heading this way now. I do have everything. You have an extra ingot for some reason. Yeah, no, that's that's the new duping strat. You always end up with an extra ingot. You always end up with one extra ingot with a new duping strat. I don't know whether it's better, to be quite honest. But... Whoop. So we go around the right way because it's less likely. Because when the Cyclops get off the rocket platform, the rocket platform is nudged slightly. And if you go around the other way, it's more likely that you'll get nudged into the wall and instantly die. Communications systems array active. It's 18 seconds from the top of this ladder. As long as I don't interact with the time capsule. Primary computer system. Hey, conveyor, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Just stop at half of the last tube instead of full. Yeah, that's true. Life yeah, just this, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Online. And. All time! 4126. 23 seconds, not bad. Could have obviously been better. Look at that stupid sparse section. Look at it. Look at that stupid sparse section. Okay. As always. Thank you very much for watching. If you're interested in the shoutouts, that's the rest of the video. If you're not, have a good day. Enjoy. On to the, the shoutouts and stuff. Hey, Justice, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Regret, no, I don't get tired of repeating myself. Willow, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Fantasy, Nine, thank you very much eight, for gifting us up. Thank you very much. Six, Lucky, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Lucky, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Two, Stasis, they told one. me to stop it. Bingo, I just had to put my foot down. Chill, thank you for the mark. Here's they told me to stop pretending to be a flamingo, I just had to put my foot down. Program, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Tig, they told me to stop pretending to be a flamingo, I just had to put my foot down. Black, they told me to stop pretending to be a flamingo, I just had to put my foot down. Snowbird, the Tobol just told me to stop pretending to be a flamingo, I just had to put my foot down. Razor, thank you very much for the 40 bits, thank you very much. Toads, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Chill, thank Caution. you for the luck. I think, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Thank you for the luck. Little Fool, they told me to stop pretending to be a flamingo, I just had to put my foot down. Wenick, thank you very much for the luck. Razor, they told me to stop pretending to be a flamingo, I just had to put my foot down. Kick, no, I don't ever get tired of repeating myself. Death, thank you very much for the 100 bits. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Bosia, no, I don't ever get tired of beating myself. Extension, no, I don't ever get tired of beating myself. Lurge, thank you very much for the luck. Pony Jumper, thank you very much for the luck. Helfa, thank you very much Confirm for 15 bits. Thank you very much. Marchant, thank you for the luck. Oh. So obviously, there's there's the time save in the sparse section. There it is. Look at that. Look at that time save. Hijinx, thank you very much for the 500 bits. 500 bits, thank you very much. Eldegoth, they told me to stop with the and go, I just had to put my foot down. Not last run, there's still three minutes left. Uh, well, there's credits. There's the credits. What is a wave without the ocean? A beginning without an end. They are different, but they go together. Now credits go and war. Stars, and I last run of the stream, always the best run of the stream. But we go together. Still room for sub 41. Yeah, I mean, that sparse section was absolutely trash. Thank you, Meep, for the 41 bits. Thank you very much. Sparse Reef, more like sparse dumb. I know, right? I know, right? Sound to finish game? I don't believe it. Would Sound to finish a game? Nah, he doesn't do that. He doesn't do that. 
sub 40 with enough R&D and movement might go. Potentially. Well, there's at least like 50 seconds in there, probably. Hey, mate, you gonna speed run below zero when it's finished? If I enjoy the game, sure. Did sound just break the 9.30 curse? Maybe, maybe. Just get world record early, Kappa. And then you don't have to go past 9.30. You can't see, but I'm tapping my head. Thank you very much, Helpful, for the 10 bits of Spaz didn't suck than Sub 41. Yeah. Spaz did suck. Hey, it's a good. It's still last run, though. That's one time there were multiple PBs in one stream. How could that even happen? How could that even happen? One more? No, we out it. We out it. It's 9.30. We're done. We're done. Welcome if you had been faster, Australia. you would have been faster. How could you say such a thing? Will be granted once so brave. Your outstanding balance of one trillion credits. So brave. Thank you very much, Corko, for purchasing a Salvan Archer. That is that is a that is the first Salvna Archer that is not myself. That's a big pop. Thank you, Coco. Cool, cool.